pandemic has dealt a catastrophic blow to everyone, including arts and culture creators and communities all over the world. Cloudgate, one of, if not the most prominent contemporary dance group in Taiwan, was no exception. Confined to their homes for months, they did what artists do. They took their lived phenomenological experience and created something. Now, as the world opens up, we come out from under our rocks to show each other the silver lining that we've each found under our collective COVID cloud. Cloudgate's performance, Send in a Cloud, is exactly that. What do you feel when you're isolated? The director, Cheng Sun Long, worked with each of the 25 dancers independently to create solo and duo performances, expressing an emotion they each felt during the lockdown. When they couldn't meet in person, they worked over Zoom from their living rooms. When they could not build group performances, they created solos and combined them now in a varied yet unified interaction, an expression of solidarity and vulnerability. The show is performed to box cello suites and accompanied by visual projections created specifically for each dance. It translates intangible into tangible, turning the dancers inside out, allowing us a peek into their souls. Some are fast, some slow. Some feel happy or sad or everything in between. Anxious, frivolous, joyful, contemplative, lonely, curious or desperate. All deeply personal. There's a great power in their vulnerability, as well as in the fact that we can't define or reliably categorize the exact emotions. Although out in the open, the dances remain personal property of the performers. A whole is more than a sum of its parts, and so it is with this dance performance. Sometimes the soloist is alone on stage, other times she's accompanied by other bodies, providing a backdrop to her expression. The performance climaxes when all the dancers meet on stage, merging their individual emotions in a complex interaction. From this interaction emerges an intensity, a catharsis of the plethora of emotions felt and expressed in the show. The repertoire of Cloudgate Dance Theatre reflects the changing status of Taiwan over the past three decades. The work of the founder and director, Lin Huai Min, and his successor, Cheng Song Lung, synthesizes the contemporary with historical and traditional, creating a unique Taiwanese language of movement. There was a hunger for dance, and we connected with people by doing our own thing. Whether we drew on folk tales or history or calligraphy, it was all recognizably part of our audience's life, says Lin. Lin refers to himself as a garbage can of a choreographer. Cloud Kids productions take inspiration from India, Europe, and elsewhere in Asia, as well as from home. You can find tales of Martha Graham's modern dance, Peking opera movements, Buddhism, Confucianism, Stravinsky, Pina Bosch, Tai Chi, and other Chinese martial arts, even Chinese calligraphy. Lynn actually compares Cloudgate style to boxing. In our dance and in martial arts, you are relaxed in preparation for moments of great intensity. You make a gesture and then you subside again like a wave. And we don't try to elevate and defy gravity. We submit to gravity and attempt to find a harmony with the earth. They comment on stories of early Chinese immigrants, the rapid urbanization of Taiwan in the 1980s, the constant turmoil, protest, and the search for, demonstration of, and creation of a Taiwanese national identity. It is, quote, a form of modern dance that, while open to Western and other influences, was intrinsically indigenous in its movements and imagery. Imagery? Imagery. <laughs> All the dancers attended dance academies alongside regular public schools. The great majority of our dancers are ordinary kids. Our performances, particularly the big, free, outdoor performances around the country, are a gift and an endorsement and an expectation from the public. And the dancers are connected to the society because it is made up of their cousins and neighbors and parents, even when we are performing in the country to farmers and melon sellers, says Lynn. From the very beginning, we didn't want performances to be monopolized by the elite, explains Lynn. Send in a Cloud will tour worldwide, but first it was performed, as Cloudgate's dances regularly are in a large public venue. This time it was the National Theatre of Taiwan. Cloudgate's contribution to Taiwanese identity thus becomes accessible and collective. Art is an interaction between artist, artwork and audience, and is thus by definition open to, um, actually demanding of interpretation. Contemporary might just be the most interpretive and subjective of dance genres, a category of movement united not by precise form, but rather by a starting point and a mindset from which each performance weaves its own narrative and communication style. Through creating their own form, each dancer is able to communicate things that cannot and perhaps should not be put into words, using their bodies as a unique tool of expression. 
they present a different kind of knowing, an interaction in which we acknowledge the interpretive nature of our shared experience, but at the same time feel that the impression is something we share and intuitively understand. They present something deeply personal to create something fundamentally collective and incredibly beautiful.